We visit Holy Grail's newest location in the town of Kapa'a today on Hawaii Time. Aloha and welcome back to On Hawaii Time. If you're new to the channel, at Komomai. Uh, today we take you to the east side of Kauai, to the town of Kapa'a, where we take you to the newest location for the Holy Grail Donut Food Truck. We invite you to join us, and all we need you to do is to relax and unwind. You're On Hawaii Time. Uh, folks, if you've been watching the channel for a while, you may have seen our other video where we featured Holy Grail Donut Food Truck down in Hana, Hanalei. Uh, they have opened up a new location on the east side of the island, uh, obviously in the town of Kapa'a, and which we're so excited about because it's literally just right down the road from where we live. So it makes it very easy for us to go get some of these tasty treats uh, that we can get there at uh, Holy Grail Donut Food Truck. Now, these donuts are unlike any other donut that you will ever bite into. It's not just the crisp that you get when you, when you first receive them because they're warm. They are made to order, but the ingredients really is the heart of this donut. Uh, the main ingredient, the main starch that is used to make the dough is taro. Now taro, another word for taro is kalo. Uh, this is one of the 27 canoe plants that was introduced to the Hawaiian Islands by the very first Polynesians when they arrived. Uh, it is also known as the plant of life. Uh, if you don't know a whole lot about taro, uh, I really recommend you to kind of Google, dive in, and learn a, a little bit about the taro plant because the history of it and how the earlier Polynesians looked at this plant is pretty amazing. Now, they also use a lot of seasonal uh, ingredients uh, that is all found right here on the island of Kauai for these locations. And one thing that's really neat is when they cook the, the donut at Holy Grail is that they are actually cooked in 100% coconut oil. So I guess if you're gonna eat a donut that would be healthy for you, this would be it. But you're not gonna feel like you're eating anything healthy because this is one of the tastiest little treats that you will have. And as you can see, these donuts aren't huge. They're actually small. Uh, bite size, if you will. For me, maybe two bites. Autumn likes to cut them in pieces and just savor it for quite a while. I can't really savor these things because they're just too darn delicious. Uh, for those of you who have actually visited the island of Kauai in the past, you know that anytime you're getting coffee or or uh, food at a restaurant, it, it's, it's a long wait just to get into these locations or even wait for the food to come to your table. You can cut your time literally in half. Uh, Holy Grail actually has an app and they just download the app and you can make uh, getting your donuts a lot quicker, right? Um, and some of you might be saying, Brody, what are you doing? I'm not even gonna be on Kauai for a while. Well, if you're visiting the island of Oahu, they have two locations there. Their flagship location is there and also down in Waikiki, they have a food truck. And if you're from the California area, maybe you're near LA, they have two locations in LA that they've just opened. So Holy Grail has like exploded and I see them moving out of the LA area and maybe venturing off to the uh, further up the Pacific Northwest into Oregon and Seattle. I don't know why they wouldn't because everybody just loves these donuts. And from our last video, we always get told that they just, they loved it. Thank you so much for uh, the recommendation of going there. Um, when I'm doing tours, I will mention Holy Grail in my tours. And I like to see people's faces light up for those who have already been there. Uh, they always like give a big old smile and a thumbs up. And, and uh, it's really neat to see that uh, people are enjoying uh, this locally made product and it is truly made with Aloha and I think everybody will enjoy this donut. So if you do get the opportunity to do it, stop off in the town of Kapa'a, try the new food truck that they have there and you can always go to the historical town of Hanalei and try their food truck that they have down there. Hours a little bit different, Friday they're open till 5 and Saturday they're open till 5 but for the rest of the week as you can see they're open just till 2. Now one thing that I want to talk about that they also have is like their chocolate milk, which is actually made with like different ingredients of what you'd find in a regular chocolate milk. Um, if your kids love chocolate milk and they don't have any type of peanut allergies, uh, this chocolate milk is incredible. 
um, you really can't tell the difference. I just had one not too long ago and it was so good. And it goes great uh, with the donuts. Otherwise, they probably wouldn't have paired it together. Uh, once again, before we close out on this video, um, this Holy Grail food truck is located in Kapa'a. It is really easy to find there in the town of Kapa'a. It's just before you exit the town of Kapa'a, heading northeastbound towards the North Shore. Uh, it's gonna be on your left-hand side, and it's gonna be right next to Tomba Surf Shop. You can also pop in and get yourself a hat, t-shirt, which is a great souvenir to take home to somebody or just be selfish and have it for yourself. Uh, super easy to get to uh, when you're coming from the North Shore because you'll turn right into the parking lot. Uh, if you're heading north uh, out of the town of Kapa'a, you'll have to fight against some traffic as you make that turn. So just drive with Aloha as you're making that turn in. You will get your Holy Grail donut uh, if you make it there safe. All right, guys, that's going to do it for our video today. With that said, we do leave you with Aloha. So can I have some now? I've been waiting. Always remember to relax and unwind. You're on Hawaii time. Aloha.